guys, Nish here from another video and today we are doing a storytelling. I have my brother here. We are, what story are we going to do? We are doing the, the Piglets and the Wolf. So let me give you an introduction to this. So I'll tell you all the characters. So there's a mom piglet, the youngest piglet, the second youngest and the eldest. We also have a bad character. You might have guessed it's the wolf. Of course, I will solve this there's fact. five? Yeah, there's five characters. Okay. So, yeah. Let me give you the scenario of it. So, it's going to be set up in like, like three houses. So, a thatched house, a sable house, which is the wooded cottage, and a brick house. So, let's start from the start. Get it? Get the, get the rhyme I did? So, there was once a mom piglet, which had three piglets. The youngest one, the second youngest one, and the eldest one. That piglet, that mom, the mom one, the mom pig, um, told them to go far away and make their own houses. It was sad and exciting at the same time. The mom piglet gave them some money and they went on a journey. The, finally, the eldest piglet made like a place, playing with this like spade his mom gave him. So, so this is where the real story starts. The youngest piglet want to be, wanted to be lazy all day and made a thatched house. It was not that stable. I mean, like, when it's windy, I think the whole house will go away. But he didn't think about that. He just ignored all its all his brothers. So he made a thatched house in one day and went to sleep, which is also really lazy. So moving on to the second piglet, he was making a stable house. This stable house would, yeah, you get the name, stable house. It's a little more stabler than the, like, the thatched house. We call it the cottage. Really cool name, but, okay, yeah. But this time, the second piglet was also really lazy. He, he finished it in two days and went to sleep. Like, the, like, he's also lazy. But the third eldest piglet, he's not lazy. He worked for two weeks and built a amazing brick house. This was all super duper cool. A chimney, like a dining room, everything, kitchen, everything. It was like his mom's house, but like ten times stronger and bigger. His well, he was working. All the other piglets were just playing, having fun, watching TV. They were not helping him. They are like, I don't care about your house. I I just care about my house. One day, a big bad wolf, get the name, big bad wolf. It was a bad wolf which was really hungry. He went to the thatched house and said, I will just open the door, I don't want to say that, but just open the door, I'll huff and puff and blow your house away. The little piglet said, no, I will never, mum warned me about this. And yeah, the wolf huffed, puffed, blew the house away. And the second piglet almost got eaten, but he ran to the, like, yeah, the stable house. Example, cottage. This time it was a little more stable. So let's see if the wolf can do this. So the wolf said, I'll the same exact thing. Open the door or I will huff and puff and blow your house away. <coughs> the piglet really was confident this time. But the still, still, the, the house got blew away. The wolf huffed, puffed, blew the house away. All the two piglets ran to the uh, eldest pig's house. It was about to be an adult, like tomorrow was a birthday, but yeah, it was a really, really bad birthday yesterday. So yeah, he was, the wolf huffed, puffed, and did not Blew, like not even one brick flew away. That that's how hard the eldest pig worked to make the wolf not come into. He's more protective than like more lazy. So the wolf think of an idea. He clue he, he like climbed up the chimney, but the eldest pig you know what? Why is the wolf always build the their houses away? Because he's strong. Like, have you ever met a wolf? They are really strong. I want to watch them in you. 
to do the good job. I mean, I don't know what to say. But the wolf <coughs> climbed up the 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 little piglet's house. But the eldest piglet saw him and put like a fire in the chimney place and a big pot, which was gonna get heated up. So climbed up the roof, went inside the chimney. But then the the pot got really hot and it fell inside the he, pot and burned. Then he broke out of the house. He just like ran to the house, yeah. No. No, I didn't drag I think he just bumped into the No, he like burnt up and died? He then he, no, he did not die. That's Grounded? Me. No. He jumped out of the house, broke the door and ran away. I but he didn't break the house, he broke the door. So, guys, I'm going to tell you the moral of the story. Bricks are better than thatch. So, the eldest piglet worked the hardest to get the brick house. He earned it by himself. I think and he could get more money if he sells that house. But how can he build the next one? He doesn't have enough money to build the next one. But although he worked the hardest and earned it. So, guys, I subscribe. No, I don't know. I'm not subscribed. You subscribe and turn on the notification bell and like. Next, next, and yeah, what? Next day we're going to do the goat and the wolf. Yeah, so it's so, not a pig, it's a goat. Yeah, so get ready for that and I'll see you next time. Bye. Bye.